give that five, four, three, two, and that should be us. Excellent. Share some system audio here. We'll do that in just a minute. And we got, is that my main man, Martin D in the chat there? Martin D, what's going on, man? How you doing today? All right, we're loading up some fresh My Vegas slots today. And I also saw Tamar Briley in the chat too. Tamar, what's going on? Good to see you, my brother. We are on day four of pestering My Vegas slots for Cosmo rewards, even though we know where they're coming. They're coming sometime next year. We don't know what time next year they're coming, but they are coming. So we'll have that. I'm pulling up my My Vegas slots right now. It is. There's some that's something we got to work on as a community here, Spinners and Sharks. We need an optimized My Vegas slots game, and uh, yeah, my My Vegas takes forever to load. It's like a it's it's been loading for like five minutes. It, it's up now. It's up now. So it's working. Oh, and we got Tracy Ford, and we got Man Man Rick from Rick's Vegas. What's going on, guys? Hey, fam. There we go. And we are just getting signed in over here. So we're going to play ourselves a little bit in my Vegas. We'll have some fun, see if we can beat this game. I'm going to present the screen now. We're going to share some system audio. Let me know if that uh, audio is a little too loud for you guys. And we're going to maximize this, and then I'll just F11 that so we have full screen. How's the audio, guys? We're doing good? And today we are going to play a little bit of Bellagio Fountain. So this is a brand new one that just came in. Going to get rid of that. Be money. What's good? How's it going, bro? We are uh, continually harassing uh, my Vegas until they bring us uh, Cosmo rewards. <laughs> so today we're going to do that by playing the Bellagio Fountains game somehow. Oh, my main man, Scott K, coming through. What's going on, Scott? How you doing? All right, we got good video, good audio, courtesy of Martin D, mod with the most here. I think Martin spends almost as much time doing the producing as Wonder Woman does, but she does the behind the scenes producing there because as you guys know, she she gets a little camera shy. She doesn't always want to do the all the production work, but that's cool. That's cool. I get a bigger let's get a bigger screen over here. There we go. We'll do, we'll do the full screen cuz there's nothing really that needs to happen. Hey, now, Scott, there, there's nothing wrong with some consistency here. A little bit of same old, same old, never hurt anybody. All right, guys, we are 10 days away from Granny Fest. So if you guys are coming to Granny Fest, you're going to be in town. Go ahead and let me know. I'm coming in uh, Friday, hanging out a little bit until Saturday afternoon. Then I'll be back. Uh, I'll be back for Halloween because Vegas Halloween. Mwah, chef's kiss. Beautiful. Love it. Okay, so it looks like we got ourselves a little bit of Bellagio over here. Let's see what the Wild Fountain feature does. Um, when a wild lands on the reels. All right, it stays on the wheels. Okay, so grow a reel to the top to win free spins. Once the feature's over, it shrinks by one symbol, and the reel heights are saved. Okay, so it's kind of like a fountain, so it's going to go up and down a little bit. It's going to go up and down, so that's fine. And then if you get three free spin reels, we get those. And then these are the bonuses, the jackpot bonuses. Okay. Free spin pays. So these are worth a little less than the free spins, but that's fine. All right. Cool. Okay, looks like we got about 600 million on the board. I think that's pretty reasonable. Um, we can probably play this for about an hour. Let's go ahead and uh, do some damage. On our marks, get set, ready, go. So it says five bonus fountains. Oh, and we get a bonus right away? That's weird. Do they have to be in a row? I wonder if they have to be in a row. Maybe that's what the trick is. They seem to have to be in a row for us to get the bonus fountain. All right, guys. But I'm not sure if you guys were here for the Hashtag Vegas podcast on Sunday, but it turns out that they have kind of addressed when we're getting uh, my Vegas rewards for Cosmo, or more accurately, when Cosmo is coming to MGM. Now, they didn't give us an exact date, but it is going to be sometime next year for, you know, for all the good that's worth. 
And then that's when Melba's going to change her hotel of choice from New York, New York to the Cosmo. We're going to be out there with Vegas Baby. It'll be awesome. How's it going, Melba? But yeah, lots to talk about there. And let's see. So we're not doing very good on this game. Every single one of these bonuses kind of pops up. But it doesn't push up. I think they have to be in a row to get the free spins. It's very strange. See, because they're all there. There's three of them there, and it's not triggering any bonuses. And that's what's weird about this. Oh! Oh, okay, that was four in a row. And that didn't do anything. Why didn't that do anything? It said three, right? Is this thing glitched? Is it bugged? And that set off another set of fountains or something? Yeah, I really don't get it. <laughs> Maybe my copy is bugged or something. I don't know. Oh, there's more wilds. Pushed up even farther. All right. I'm going to keep pushing up. Oh, yeah, it did push up. It's more bonus. It does count from both sides, though. So that's kind of interesting. That's kind of interesting, I guess. Hmm. Oh, do we have Hollywood in the house? Hollywood! Maybe we have to get this to, like, the top of the screen or something for it to work. Alright, maybe that's maybe that's the trick. We have to get to the top of the screen to make that work. And we've got three more bonuses. 540, but looks like th those are out of lights, so they drop back down. That was a win, though. Yeah, we're just winning nothing. We got nothing on this one. <laughs> I kept seeing all these uh, all these big wins on the Reddit group, so I figured this would be a good one to try, but I guess we used up all the luck. That's a shame. Uh, I think my Vegas can hear me though. So let's see if they actually hear me and then they give us a they give us a bonus. Before COVID, favorite room was Park MGM. So, Mub, are you willing to switch over to uh, Cosmo if you get MGM rewards for it, or if you get Cosmo rewards, like identity rewards just from the My Vegas or whatever, whatever combination is? That's the real question. Actually, Spinners and Sharks, you guys should comment. Oh, wait. Oh, is that okay? So we got six of them. So we got them all in a row. All right, now we finally get a bonus. We get five bonus fountains. So let's see how we do. <laughs> it's actually singing. Okay, so that's the 1.2 billion. All right, go off, go off. That's what's up. Let's see. And it's gonna hit again. All right, so all right, 600 million. Not bad, not bad. Yep. See Hollywood. No, no sooner did you say that, that's when uh, that's when it kicked back up. All right, major jackpot. Let's go. Come on, give us a 1.2 bill. Okay, 300, 300. Not bad, not bad. All right, we get two more. We get two more. Oh, let's see how the mega goes. Let's get that mega. It's going to give us 600 mil. Yeah, called it. That's fine. That's fine. We'll stay at it. That was 2.7 billion. All right. Let's see how it does. Oh, mega jackpot. 24 billion. Okay, okay. 26 billion, 700 million chips in the bonus let's go that's actually pretty good i can work with that we'll have to clip this for the uh we'll have to do a clips channel or something like that yes sir <laughs> well done spinners and sharks we did great all right so we'll hack at it for a little while longer maybe we'll switch games at about uh 5 30 5 30 vegas time and then i'll I know that's not local time for a lot of you guys. We'll call it a win, though. We'll call it a win for sure. Oh, man. Okay, so you have to get them all in a row seems to be the trick. All the bonus girls in a row. And is that is that Nami Konami down there? Or is that a different character? I don't know who that is. My main man, Terry. Terry, I'm still going to see you in 10 days, right? We're going to be at Granny Fest. We're going to see the main man, Terry. I'm looking forward to that. So that'd be good. 
on Saturday. All right, let's go. Tracy's back on Saturday. Ah, uh, Melbus, we got it. Five bonuses all the way across. There we go. All right, cool, Terry. I'll see you there. First round's on me, man. First round. Depending on what we're drinking, though, I'm not sure how much longer we'll last into a second or third. <laughs> Okay, so that hit again. Alright, so if we get five more across all the way through. That's all the reels, though. That's what I don't like about six reel slots. It's just too much to do. Six reel slots are just too much to do. But that's fine. This one's going alright. Alright, so we need another... Come on, another bonus. Uh, we need another wild. There we go. Let's see how we did here. Yeah, it's just pulling uh pulling chips out, guys. 30 million. Yeah, Vegas to Cali in the house. That's what's up. <laughs> I know, got you pretty bad, right? <laughs> it goes through. <laughs> yeah, no, this, this one's been kinda it's been kinda up and down for me over here. Mm. Yeah, you gotta get them all in a row. That's the problem. Yeah, six bonuses all the way across. Really kind of ropes you in there. See, that was almost it. That feels like a tease. Or that, too. Like, who was that for? Wasn't for me. Oh, is that Lucky Dog? Oh, woo! <laughs> Jason, what's going on, my man? How you doing? It's been a minute. You got to get back on the show, bro. We got to get you back on. You coming to Granny Fest, bro? I know Vegas to Cali is coming through. She might be bringing Mini Cali, too. I don't know. Don't worry, Lucky Dog. It, it, it hates all of us. Bellagio Fountains hates all of us. We should get a good a woo in the chat. Let's get a big There we go. All right. Yeah, we we we've all just been getting beaten <laughs> like just buy this game. I don't know. We gotta hold out another 17 minutes. Yeah, we're already back down below our initial bet. I think our initial stake was 155 billion. We got back above it to 172. Oh, please tell me I didn't crash it. I might have crashed the game. Yeah, see, now it's gonna crash on us, guys. <laughs> Oh, man. All right, G2 in October. Okay, that works. That works, man. I'm only going to be in town for Granny Fest, unfortunately, but I will be there for Vegas Halloween if y'all are going to be in the in the house. But we only have the one fountain bonus, and then I froze the game. There we go. Now we gotta, Now we got to clear this. We got to clear our cash. All right. These are all the games I have. We could play some blackjack too, but I really do want to finish this game. We'll reload it. On this Sunday, praying it will still be the next Friday night. I know it's been real pricey too. Uh, I, I got a, I got a pretty good deal. I've got a weird hotel review for you guys. That's going to be coming up. I can't wait to show you this weird hotel. That I also have to go to by myself. Because Wonder Woman's like, yeah, I'm not going to make this one. We'll do Halloween. I was like, okay. Oh, my man, Dan. Dan Dragonfly in the house. What's good? What's good? 
You guys caught me hanging out being healthy now. Just drinking my water over here. Just got back from workout. I'm gonna be super ripped for Halloween. No, I'm not. <laughs> I think I, I think I'm up about two kilograms, maybe. I mean that's like four and a half pounds, so I'm up about two kilos. If I do another month, I might get another two kilos in. So we'll see how it goes. But I'm working on it. I'm working on it. I'm in that gym. Doing the rest days too, though. You got to do the rest days. Got to take it slow. So I'm doing the rest days. Uh, man, this thing really needs to be optimized. So my Vegas, I know you guys watch this. Oh, let's see. My my Vegas broke. I have to get in touch with Play Studios. I have to have them fix an issue. Major bummer. Haven't got a free room since Kino's wedding. I've had the credits. Oh yeah, gotta get that fixed. I I think the My Vegas app needs some optimization. Um, because it, it it's just been kind of rough to get it rolling on on the phone now, which is weird because that's what it was initially designed for. But I think since they also migrated over into the web browser, that's been kind of a problem. And I'm wondering if they're using the same servers or if their servers haven't expanded vertically enough, or not vertically, but horizontally enough. I'm sure they've got the muscle for it. They just need to expand it out a little bit more. I'm not sure if they're using Azure or what sort of VMs they're using. I assume they're using VMs and not data center, but I've never actually been to Play Studios. So that'd be a really fun thing to do. I should reach out to Play Studios and see if they wouldn't mind giving me a tour or something. See where the magic happens, right? Um, but, I mean, it, it's been like this kind of loading up. It took me like 10 minutes to get this to load before the stream. It's killer. Oh, yeah. Damn. No, it's been rough. Like, you think getting the Bellagio buffet has been rough? I've been trying to get that two-for-one buffet for a month, and I can't get it. I've snagged the MGM one. I've snagged the Excalibur. I've snagged the Luxor. I've snagged those easily. But I can't get this damn Bellagio buffet, which is the one I want. So I'm probably going to have to use my comp dollars on it. MGM rewards people looked at it in April. It had me reinstall it. still won't work. Um, I'm wondering, uh, Vegas Scott, I bet you if you clear your cache too, if you clear the app data on your phone maybe, that might do it. Is it crashing or is it not loading properly? What kind of symptoms are you having? Maybe we can turn this into a troubleshooting stream. <laughs> maybe that's what I'll do. I'll just, I'll just like blow this all away. Right, comp dollars, right? That's what I'm just gonna have to use if I want uh, those buffets. I'm just gonna charge it back to the room and be like, hey, we're getting, we're getting comp dollars back on this. Let's go. All right, I'm gonna give it two more minutes. I'm gonna give it two more minutes. If it doesn't load, then I'm gonna see if I can like uninstall it, blow away the app data. I'm gonna go into settings and do that. And then we'll try it like that, maybe. Oh, oh, I saw it inch. I saw it inch a little bit. They only allow so many rewards used per day, so it won't affect ours enough to sell out. Yeah. Yeah, Martin's got a good idea, like uh, Vegas to Cali, if you try um, signing in on, what is it, try signing in like a, on a different phone, maybe, or on a, uh, on an emulator or something, that might work, so that's an idea. Um, what day am I arriving? I'm arriving on the 14th. So that'll be that Friday, I'm staying for the night, and then I'm going home Saturday afternoon. I think my flight, uh, I think my flight leaves at 2. So, that'll be fun. And then I'll be back on Sunday the 30th, so I'll be back in two weeks after that. I may as well just buy a house in Vegas. It'll be cheaper than buying one here in Colorado. Sell this one because you know we sell this one and we have nowhere to live <laughs> that'd be the problem i'm gonna buy my free room it lets me when i go to book it via email they send it it gives me an error message that says i've exceeded the limit that's weird and you said the last time you used it was in march 
That is weird. Because it's been way past then, so you should be able to use... Unless it's, like, the same room, then I think it's actually six months. It's this, like, hidden thing. You can only use the same offer once in six months for a specific room. But if you do a different hotel, I think you can. I don't know. It's weird. Might have to read into that one a little bit. Um, was there an update? Because you put money into the, get the two nights and you can't see them at all. Uh, check your location settings, one on one ink, because I know I have the two nights. Um, oh, come on, come on. It's got another one that's coming up. Let's take a look at the rewards while we're here. <laughs> I know, right? Yeah, I'm a little wild. I'm a little wild, though. Yeah, you can allow that. That's fine. It's not going to find it. It's a, it's an emulator, so it's not going to see it. Hmm. Just for luxury. Yeah, so that's an entirely different property, so it shouldn't really matter. All right, let's use Lagio over here. Let's see. Yep, this is always sold out. This is the one I really want, is the two-for-one buffet. Because th these are like $47 buffets. I think it'd be worth it for like the 20-something and change for the two-for-one, but yeah, God, it's too much. Um, yeah, two complimentary nights. So one-on-one ink, I can still see it. Check your location settings, maybe. Interesting. They used to give away weekend comps left and right. No, not a single weekend. Yeah, you know, it's it's weird because it seems to be going up and down. It all seems to be relative to how the market's going and what they're getting out of it. And right now, casinos are on a little bit of a winning streak. They're on like an, a two-year winning streak when it comes to now that the, the, the P word is over and people are able to travel again. There's a lot of pent-up travel demand. Like they can't, you know, they can't get enough people on planes now they can't get big enough planes to get people to vegas they can't get enough limos to get people to vegas it's a whole thing yeah over six months hopefully yeah finger yeah fingers crossed fingers crossed stuff uh go ahead and pm me if you get stuff we'll figure it out we'll figure it out All right, let's get back. Yeah, that's another one. Yeah, try clicking on it from your uh, from your laptop too. That's a good idea if you got one. I gotta start a club. I don't think I'd remember to play every day though, <laughs> even though I have two and a half million loyalty points now. All right, let's see if we can get get any of our uh, any of our nest egg back over here. Remember when my Vegas gave us 500 billion chips that one time? Let's we'll see if this thing actually loads up. Yeah, I think there's some optimization issues going on with the game right now. And they're going to have to sort that out. That might be why it's been so hard to get a couple of these uh, rewards. To Damn, 2.4 billion. All right. Yeah, they were still on fire back then, so. They were giving away stuff left and right at that point. Come on, give us another one. Oh, there's another one. All right, seven billion. Okay, that was pretty good. Oh, that's another, okay, 2.6 billion. It's keeping us afloat. I think we get one more with this stack over here. Oh, there's another one for the back stack there. Here's my computer, right? <laughs> oh, Dan's got a good question. Uh, Wonder Woman is in, into the... Oh, I would love to go to a boxing event or a UFC event at T-Mobile personally. 
Uh, yeah, Wonder Woman. I think her big thing is she doesn't want me fighting anymore. Um, I don't think she doesn't have any problems with me training individually, but she, I don't think she wants me to compete. Is the big thing. So I'm sure I could definitely go to one of those things. She's just like, no, you don't need you don't need to be like a pro fighter. You, you know, it's okay. You use brain. No, no, use muscles. It's okay. <laughs> But no, I'm sure she'd be fine with that. Actually, I've taken her to uh, to like an amateur event, like uh, my old uh, my old sensei. Actually, um, he was fighting at a at a local arena here, so they did they did some boxing, um, and then they had the they had the women's uh, MMA event beforehand, and then they had the men's MMA event right after that. So we, we kind of skipped over a lot of the boxing because I'm not a boxer and she's uh, she's not super into boxing anyway. So we went to the so we watched the the women's MMA event and they were just, like they were like devastating. I could feel the shock waves. Like we we were like in the front row, but they they went hard. Like amateur fighting, you have a I guess you have a bigger chip on your shoulders. So you're working a lot harder. But yeah, no, they they went hard on that one. I gotta admit, that was a really good fight, and uh, so I got to see my sensei fight too, and uh, it was really fun. So she had a good time. She's not really big on fighting in general, but she finds it interesting. So. Yeah, I think uh, I think we'd probably do that. I think it's the crowds at a professional one. That'd be probably that probably be the trick, getting her to go to a big professional fight and fight through the crowds. Hey Denise, how's it going? Yeah, one on one. Yeah, I'd love to do that. I mean, if, I think if the tickets aren't so expensive, if, if I got like a comp ticket or whatever, then that's one of those things. Yeah, yeah. Wonder Woman. I'm not. I'm not allowed to fight anymore. Otherwise, she's gonna beat my ass, <laughs> and we don't want that, guys. <laughs> It'll be the Ace of Comas. <laughs> Damn, nah, nah. We ain't gonna have any of that. Come on! Oh man, we were just like we were this close. Those are in the wrong columns. I should look at some other rewards for my Halloween trip because I'm going on Halloween and that's the trip I'm going to use most of the rewards. play it down to 100 billion if we lose we lose that's as far as we'll play it down to then we'll look at some other stuff bacon nation hold up hold up biggest cali what is bacon nation tell us about that hold up oh that's gonna be downtown at the d isn't it that's gonna be a 24 7 brunch yo let me see Oh, look at this. Different types of bacon there. Checking out the menu on this. Checking it out on my other screens. Oh, yeah, during the Super Bowl, food room. Yeah, 2024. That's going to be a huge time. Like, that's probably going to be the busiest, like, February ever. I don't think we're ever really going to see any low seasons in Vegas anymore. It'll probably be part of it'll be like part of april part of january and part of december going forward whenever I, I don't think we're gonna see any like low-key weekends for a very long time like maybe before preseason in august i might i might say maybe some preseason games uh for the raiders then but that's about it otherwise otherwise ish is gonna get pretty wild i'll tell you Yep, best new restaurant. I'm looking forward to it. Yeah, maybe we'll go ahead and pop by there. Maybe we'll do like a uh, maybe. I think we we've got a bar crawl down there, so maybe we'll go there before or after dinner. I have to double check. New York strip steak, thirty-two bucks. It's actually it doesn't look too expensive, offhandedly. I'm looking at it now on the on my other screen. Jumbo shrimp scampi? Oh my word. 
It's also gonna have bacon everywhere too, like lemon pepper bacon. This is nuts. This, this is wild. Wow. A few of these websites could use some optimization. Dan Vegas will extend time set on the F1 formula. Yeah. And a hundred thousand dollar room packages. That'd better be a whole ass villa for a hundred thousand dollars. You better get everything. Dude, same. We gotta look up the giant schedule, see when they're playing in Vegas. I I don't think it's gonna be until like 2024, though. Because I think last time they played, it was in MetLife. Yeah, because that was last year, November 7th. They played at MetLife, at MetLife Stadium. And so that was two years ago. Or no, that was November 21st. So they won't play this year. They won't play next year. It'll be in 2024, probably about then. That was week nine. So hopefully that's soon. Vegas gonna like bang. Yeah, that's gonna be a wild year for him over there. It's gonna be a good time. One on one, we're gonna save up. We're gonna go to see the Raiders lose to the Giants in at Allegiant Stadium. We're gonna make that happen, man. That's gonna be a thing that happens. Oh, Brett, you up to 14 million. Dude, I just broke two and a half. I barely broke two and a half. I'm spending mine. I'm definitely spending mine though. But still, that's amazing. You can get yourself a cruise. Brett, why haven't you taken a cruise yet? You looking at the cruises? Spinners and Sharks, I think we need to have, uh, we need to help Brett shop for some rewards. He's got 14, almost 15 million loyalty points. How many of those do you get in a month, man? You get like a million loyalty points a month. Easy, don't you? He probably does. He probably does. Brett's better at my Vegas than I am. That's really awesome. I love that. All right, let's see if we get anything. Ah, oh, we're not getting anything off this one. We're coming up on our 100 billion. I don't know, Spenders and Sharks are up on that 100 billion. We may not make it. Oh, come on, come on. Might have to refill refill my chip supplies after this. Huh? It is just raking us over the coals here. Dragging us through the mud. Hmm. Yeah, we need this bonus fountain over here. We need lucky bonus fountains. 200 million? My man, what, what are you going to do with 200 million loyalty points, bro? What are you going to do with all that? You going to buy a casino? Are they going to give you one? <laughs> well, they going to... Oh, 20 million. Still though, 20 million. What are you gonna do with that? Oh, I forgot to plug my computer in, guys. I'm sorry. I drained my battery. There we go. 20 million. Brett, that is that is nuts. Going hard. He's gonna take like nine cruises back to back. He's just gonna be like, screw it. Take it a cruise. Stop me. I won't. You won't. You won't. And you know what? I won't. <laughs> Let me know when you're ready for that cruise, bro. All right, we're coming up. Yeah, we just passed 100 million. We're going to lose that. <laughs> I know, right? No, but I've, I've been playing for 10 years. I don't have that many loyalty points. <laughs> All right. <laughs> 20,000 loyalty points, right? Steph, Steph is just trying to catch back up. Oh, Tracy got jokes. <laughs> You're not wrong, though. You're not wrong. I think the three of us are finally starting to sound alike a little bit. Nothing. Ah, lame sauce, lame sauce. All right, well, we hit our 100 million. So we just lost 50 billion loyalty points, or loyalty points. My Vegas trip's trying to beat this thing. <laughs> Oh, man. Nah, forget about it. No, Steph, you got to get the free play. You got to get the free play, too. You got the free play. You got to get the other discounts. I assume I've saved, like, I don't know. I, I, I must have saved thousands just on this game. 
just playing this game here. Let's do a little bit of reward shopping for our boy Brad over here. Let's see what we can get this man. For myself and my buddies too, for their rooms a week, a few weeks, I have it. Yeah, you can, you can, you can bring a whole wedding party, man. I think that's the only thing is you can't transfer these things. So once you get past a certain point, they're not very useful. Like it, you don't even bother looking at anything below fifty thousand. I remember when like tw like using twenty five thousand loyalty points was a big deal to me. Now I'm just like. Mm. Yeah, maybe pop slots. Yeah, yeah, no, so yeah, Sin, Sin, Sin don't play with the slots over there. She'll be like, hey, free money is free money. She does not give a damn. Her and, uh, her and Mark, they're just like, nah, give me the free stuff. Give me those free, uh, give me the free slots. Give me the free, yeah, anything free they can get. They're all over it. Now, here's the worst part. This is the most expensive thing you can get right now, usually. Like, you get the private table at National Harbor. Oh, see, there you go. That's a good call. That's a good call. No, but uh, did you did you get that, like, nighttime, daytime? You got to, like, message me and let me know how you got your Bellagio Buffet. I am just struggling to get one. I'm just really struggling to get a Bellagio Buffet coupon right now. I desperately want one. I usually have them, and I'm just struggling to get one now, now that I'm actually going. Uh, let's see. You gotta go to... So, Brett, you gotta go to MGM National Harbor to get some stuff. Uh, get some free play, for sure. 150 in free play available at Mandalay Bay, finally. That's pretty dope. Uh, let's see. What else is good to get? Bellagio, $100 in free play. This requires a paid stay, though. My problem is I always... I never pay for the stays. Like, I'll get two comp nights over here, um, and then I'll have Wonder Woman get the other one. So then we just have three free comp nights, and then it's just, like, $35 a night for the resort fee or $45 a night or whatever it ends up being. I think it ends up being, like, $135 after tax title and whatever. So it's not so bad. Um, let's see. What else can we get? This doesn't even have all the stuff in it, really. Finger-looking foodie tours. Where's this at? Um, downtown Lip Smack and Foodie Tours. To, oh! Complimentary two-and-a-half-hour tour. That's kind of cool. Optional beverage package. Three dollars per person. That's kind of cool, though. That might not be a bad one to take. Maybe I'll save that. Maybe I'll get, look into that soon. There's so many cool things to grab, and then you just gotta gotta plan around it. Oh, and Merlin, I gotta get one of these too. I've been having a pretty easy time getting these. That was a good time. All right, Steph, we'll see you. Steph, we're gonna see you that Friday, because you're going you coming to Granny Fest with us. We know, we know you're coming through. I wonder if they're doing any other cruises. Let's go ahead and go by categories. See if they got anything good. Because my, my, my usual goal is rooms first, then food, then entertainment, and if I have anything left over, free play. So I usually start with uh, rooms first, of course. I'll go to a restaurant. I wonder if they're... We can sort by partners, too. Oh, terrible experience, so don't waste it on that one. All right, Christy. All right, let's go. All right. I, I, I'm going with you guys. I'll go with you guys. That'll be fun. You guys know. I mean, I'm, 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 you know, I'm bodybuilding. I gotta, I gotta hit those macros. All right, let's get to the very end over here. See if there's anything good. It's a Viking sport. Oh, that looks new. What is this? Bogo meals. Is this in Vegas? That's some bonus points. Viking sports club. What is this? What is it? What even it? Oh, that's in Dundas Valley. That's not very helpful. Interesting. Once you request a custom reward through your personal host, there's a 90-day waiting period. Huh. Good to know, Andrew. 
Maybe that's the thing I'll do. Maybe I'll, maybe we'll save up enough from the Patreon to get a custom to get a custom host one of these days and see if we can get a custom reward. I don't know what we do though. What would you guys? What would we even do with the custom rewards, Minister Sharks? Let me know what you guys think. All right, Christina, we're watching you guys. You and Anthony, watching y'all. Oh. Tickets to a big... Oh, yeah, that'd be a good idea. Anything change on the free play from casinos when not staying there? Very good question, PJ. Um, it's pretty much limited to my Konami slots. So the so the regular My Vegas free play is kind of a thing that you can't get unless you have... You know, unless you're staying there for a paid stay. But if, you, if you're using my, my Konami Connect rewards, you can do that. Problem is it's still limited to $25, so... That's the big issue. Oh, Royal Caribbean still got some good stuff here. What's up? Let's see what they got. Oh, they stopped. They stopped the cruises. They stopped the cruises. That's a shame. Uh, what else they got? Yeah, there's the finger looking foodie tours we're looking at. Oh, look at that. The one eight hundred flowers. I keep forgetting about that. Fellas, is anybody mad at you right now for only uh, seventy five or seventy five hundred? My biggest loyalty points. You can buy their affection back. <laughs> oh, The Fifth Elements. I did like that movie. Good call, Klondike. I like that. Merlin's still worth it, because you can still get the Madame Tussauds. We're going to Madame Tussauds, actually, finally. So I'm really looking forward to that. Because uh, I've got one of these in my wallet. What is this, though? Sea Life, Arizona. Okay. I remember that because I gotta buy one, get one free too. Oh, Browns versus Tampa there. Oh, Brett, Brett, are you a Browns fan? One of my bros, he's a he's a big time Browns fan. He's been hardcore since like 1960. I was like, wow. Oh, 90 day waiting period until you can request another custom reward. I have no idea what the hell I would even ask for. All right, Spenders and Sharks, tell me in the live chat right now, if you had a My Vegas host and you asked for a custom reward, what would that custom reward be? In Martin, no, you can't have, uh, you can't have like one of the girls from Fantasy in a take home bag. That's not how that works. It doesn't work like that, man. I wonder what's in the my events right now. Is there anything good coming up? November second meetup. It's I, you know I'm leaving on the second anyway, so it wouldn't really wouldn't matter. I'd have to extend my stay. When is this? The thirteenth. Ah, uh, it's Run Casino, and it's on the thirteenth. That's a shame. Yeah, save those custom rewards for a really special week. I can't really think of anything other than, like, maybe, like, a special suite or something like that. Like, a three-day free suite or something would be huge for me. I think that I would be really excited about. I don't know how many loyalty points that would be. Like, a million loyalty points to stay at uh, Nightingale Suites or something. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll save it for when uh, Cosmo gets uh, purchased. Oh, the dining experience inside the Bellagio Conservatory. That's a good idea. That's a really clever one. More free play. That's another good one. Okay, all right. You can never beat free play. Never beat free money. Never. Don't don't forget to take advantage of that. Martin, you got to come up with something, man. You got to come up with something that isn't women. <laughs> no women, no drugs, man. <laughs> Sweden free play confirmed. Confirmed. Uh, let's see what else we got in here that we can. Is there anything else good to snag or look at? Let's see. Checkers and rallies. I don't know if Wolfgang Puck has anything else new. He used to have some pretty wild um, rewards for that too. I think I might have found a hack to get around doing like the, you know, just the one per table. Two beverages.
present your printed email confirmation and valid ID to re- to redeem the free entree. Offers presented on your phone will not be accepted. Well, that's a lie. <laughs> they will accept it on your phone. They will absolutely accept that on your phone. They do not give a damn. Because it's not their problem. They may ask to look at the phone there. Hmm, $25 off the purchase of two entrees and beverages. I wonder which one's better, though. Damn, brand, bar, and grill menu. I wonder which one's a better deal. I think the free entrees is a better deal. I'm going to bring that in. We're going to find out. This is probably a website that needs to be optimized, too. I know, Zadi! <laughs> like, for real, for real. 2005. Nonsense. <laughs> Mar- Martin D is going to ask for a, a, a kick in the shins <laughs> for his reward. That's what he's asking for. Yo, my main man, PJ. Always happy to help. PJ, when's the next, uh, when's the next stream? We all got to drop in there. Cleveland Brown season tickets around... Oh, okay. All right. Five... Man, you're hardcore. All right. But that'd be pretty cool. That'd be pretty cool. Yeah, let me see. Oh, Andrew had an experience. Coughed up a lot of rewards. Got some room credits. 200... That's a good reward, too. Getting some room credits. So that way, if you don't have, like, a deal for something... You can just use the rest on, like, um, food and drink or something. You know what I really want? I think what I really want is I would want a free cabana. That would be a huge thing for me, getting a free cabana. Or a day bed or something. Something like that at, like, MGM Grand or Mandalay or whatever. That I, that I think would be great. So, we'll have to think on that. All right, let's have a look at the menu here, see which one is the best reward. I think it is the free entree. I don't remember what the pricing is. I used to have the prices on the menu. Uh, Alibit, Ribot. Oh, they changed up the they changed up the menu on us. Yeah, because now they got a prime ribeye in here. They got a margarita pizza. They got wild mushroom, grilled prime burger. Yeah, let's get a couple of ribeyes there. That's the way to do it. Yeah, they got the strip steak in here, prime cut fillet. Because they used to have a hanger steak, I think. I guess they stopped doing that. Yeah, so they updated this menu. Okay. Alright, and this is the lunch menu. So this must be the dinner menu. Yeah, it strikes me that getting the the two or... Yeah, it seems like getting the $25 would be less helpful than the free entree with purchase, so I'd probably say the free entree is the way to do it. Vegas morning Starbucks and slap. Okay, yeah, let me know, man. Let me know. We're going that. Banana cabana. No. <laughs> no, but no. I, I'd even settle for like an Excalibur cabana or maybe one of the Luxor ones. Um, I think there was, a, there was a couple that was a travel blog channel that was like, yeah, Lux, Luxor is pretty awesome. Like, it beats Mandalay and Bellagio and places like that. And I don't know about all that. I think TVP did a, did a video about it already. And I'm like, that's a good time, but I don't know about all that. <laughs> I, I think Luxor is a little underrated for what it is, but it, it, it can't hang with Mandalay. It can't hang. Like, it's got a better location. I'll give it that. And it is mildly cheaper for what you're getting. You're, it, it's a bit cheaper, I'd say, but... Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Mandalay all day. I'd rather stay at Mandalay. They'll, they'll, they'll put me in Delano if nothing else. They'll usually take care of me somehow or another. So, yeah, they're, uh, they're my spot, for sure. Mm-hmm. Enter the way to charge to the room, right? Yeah, that's another one. Yeah, use your other credits, too. So use the 
pre-purchase with Entree, then take care of the rest just on the uh, on the hotel. Call it good. So that's the smart way to do it, I'd say. What's this one? Wolfgang Puck. Where's this? Oh, downtown Summerlin. So you got to go downtown for that. That's kind of neat. Where's Lupo? I think that's at Mandalay Bay, isn't it? Yeah, Lupo by Wolfgang Puck. That's Mandalay Bay. Yeah. I am just so hyped. Yeah, we're going in 10 days. So I'm going in 10 days just for Granny Fest. Just want to hang out with folks. And then after that gonna head back and then i'm gonna do another we're doing a vegas halloween party so that's gonna be really cool like we've already ordered a case of wine for it so we've got a friend that actually got a deal with some wine so uh they got us some free wine already that's already gonna be at the hotel um probably gonna do um what else we're we gonna do there oh yeah that's right Paige. yeah no more Mirage Rewards. So I'm not sure if you guys notice the Spinners and Sharks as we go through the partners over here. You see, they, they mixed up the cards a little bit. So we have the Bellagio, the flagship of the of the fleet here. We have New York, New York. That's I think I think that's the best budget property of the MGM um, portfolio there. Beats uh, MGM Grand in that it's a little more walkable and it's a fun spot. MGM Grand, of course. There's Aria. And then Wolfgang Puck works a lot with MGM. You have Excalibur. You have Vidara, which still has nothing. Vidara has nothing. This is like like $75 food and beverage credit. That's neat. So if you get it on a good day, that's awesome. But otherwise, it's just like, you know. And then, of course, you have Mandalay Bay, which is my new home property. And then we've got Luxor. And that's about where it ends. And there's no more uh, Vegas properties that we get to use. Because Mirage is officially gone. So, it's one of those deals. But yes, Minister Sharks, Mirage is officially off the books. If you didn't use your rewards on September 30th, refund them now or forever hold your peace because they're expired. They're not useful anymore. If if they're even in your wallet anymore. So, that's the other kick. If they're even still in your wallet and you can get anything back. Uh, contact, when am I going? I will be there the 14th and leaving the 15th and I'll be there October 30th and I'll be I'll be leaving the 2nd. So those are my next dates. So that's about what we look in. Ask your host for upcoming rewards or events. Oh yeah, that's pretty cool. Yeah, we're going to have to do that. I guess the real question is how will we get up to level 7? I'm going to have a look. Because you gotta, you got to put some cash in to get to level 7, I'm certain. I'm on level 3 right now, and I can maintain that pretty stably. Yeah, 60,000. So, <laughs> I'd have to do 100 times more gaming to get to that. But then you get to keep it for a full 90 days, too. So, that's kind of cool. Personal host, priority support, high roller room confirmed... Yeah, because that's going to be at least... I'm sure it's going to be at least $1,000 to get all that. Get that Opal category. Let me see, because how many points do you get just for buying? Because uh, that's worth 8000 so let's do some calcs. So you get 60000 about about 8000 Times 79.99. $750. Okay, that's that's not bad. That's not bad, actually. That's pretty workable. So $750, that's the that's the magic number, it seems. Bring on the Cosmo. Yeah, oh god. Yeah, they, they're, they're not even getting Cosmo and MGM grant or MGM rewards. Dude, we're gonna miss each other for like two days. That's the worst part. That's the worst part. It's all right though. There are other days, Drew. We will keep you updated, man. It'll be all right. We gonna make it happen. 
And Lizzie has a $150 one. Uh, yeah, we can look into that. Let's go look at that. Uh, I do believe you do have to stay there, but we'll look at the terms and conditions just right quick. There we go. Fastest thing alive, Sonic. Alright, PG, I'll see you next week, man. Can't wait to see you, bro. Alright, let's get in here. $150 in free play. Let's see what you need for this. Minimum paid three nights stay to receive $150. It's a premium reward. Yeah, when you book a three night stay. Series within 90 days to purchase. Okay. Oh, yeah, that's not a bad idea. I wouldn't mind doing an update. I gotta do an updated strategy video on all of them. I always say I'm gonna start, but I think during my Christmas break, I usually take a Christmas break to spend time with them. That's when I'm gonna. I'll, I'll film a couple of them. I'll, I'll, I'll take a week or two. Because the games have changed so much since I made my initial strategy guides. And I've also, I've also got much better equipment too. I have much better recording software. I have much stronger editing PCs now. There's just so much more I can do. And the editing program within of itself has built in, gotten better. Oh, Auntie Sin, we were just talking about you. Shout out to Cinnamon Girl. Have you guys heard Sin and uh, Mark's new podcast? It's Penny for Vegas and Cinnamon Girl. They've got a new podcast. It's the hashtag Hot Mess. Is it hashtag Hot Mess Express? Or is it just the Hot Mess Express podcast? I think it's one of those things. Uh, Sin, Sin, you arrived on island time. You know, you got here when you got here. That's how it is. Andrew's at level 6,890. One spin at level 7 is 6,000 loyalty points. Good God. And you can get 15,000. There's no point. There's no point in this brother even playing. That's wild. Okay. It's the Hot Mess Penny Express. That's what it is. That's what it is. The Hot Mess Penny Express. I should get you guys a copy of that. Here it is. This is the most recent episode I've got. I'm gonna share that in the live chat here. So remember correctly, Sin was ranting about, she was ranting about a lot of stuff. Yeah, listen to that in the car, listen to that on the way to work. Don't forget to go check uh, check our mates out over there. They're gonna take, you, take good care of you. Always some good stuff. So, shout out to Cinnamon Girl, shout out to Penny for Vegas. I hope I get to see you guys at least sometime this month. Next week it'll be from Vegas, okay. Sin, are you still gonna be there on the Friday, the 14th? If not, it, are you gonna be in town on, well you can PM me, I'll, I'll PM you about it. But we got our dates solidified, so we're going to have to see you. Eh, anytime, fam. Anytime. Yep. Yeah, Tracy's going to be there, too. I can't, it's going to be such a... It's going to be such a huge venue. There are going to be so many people. It's going to be the wildest thing. I'm looking forward to this. I should get some Shark Reef tickets. That'd be kind of fun. I'm not sure if we're gonna have enough time though. I'm looking at my itinerary and it just filled up. Like we got stuff planned for Sunday when we fly in. We got stuff planned for Monday. We got stuff planned for Tuesday, Tuesday, and then we got to fly back out Wednesday. So I don't want to overdo it. So that's gonna be the big thing there. Oh, and there's some main man Tim over there. Tim ever is coming through. Twenty-five dollars super chat. Going straight into the gambling fund, my friend. Thank you very much for that. Tim's been here since, like, 2017, 2018. I think he was, like, one of my first, like, five subscribers. He came straight from the My Vegas group. Tim is constantly, <laughs> like, contributing to the delinquency <laughs> of Ace of Vegas. It's amazing. Yeah, 2017. So he was here for the very first... Yep, 2017. Can't confirm. He's been here for the from the very first set of videos. Because I did, like, two of them. In, in 2017 when I first started. So he was like the first subscriber on the scene. 
at the 11th, leave it. Ah, oh, so you're only doing one night, too. One night show with Sin. Can confirm. That's alright, though. Yeah, Shark Reef is crazy. Hmm. That's also an interesting one. 400 to spin. Oh, Kristen, Kristen's coming to Van Granny Fest, too. So this is going to be a really good, really good week. I'm looking forward to this. All right. All right, Spinners Instructional. It is about that time. It is 6 o'clock Vegas time. That means I've got to meet my macro, so I've got to get some dinner in. And I promised Wonder Woman we'd watch some Rings of Power tonight. So we're going to go watch some Elo, Lord of the Rings, and get re get ready for more Vegas shenanigans. Uh, I think I've got a Throwback Thursday video coming up that I did with Eat Travel Dude um, last year that we just never got around to editing. So I thought I'd go ahead and send that out there, see if I can drag them out of hiding too and talk them into coming to Vegas. So that'd be fun. I'll talk, talk to Memo, see if he wants to come through. But all right, Spinners and Sharks. So thanks again. Thanks for coming through again. Big shout outs to uh, Tim Hunt for coming through again. $25 super chat, making sure that I, actually that 25 bucks, I was probably gonna prime my machine because I'm also gonna use a lot of free play. So that's all gonna be free money, bro. And then we're, we're buying rounds. Tim, if you make it out to Granny Fest, go ahead and pick me up and buy me a round. Can't argue with me on that one. You're getting around or whatever. So, all right. But yeah, till next time, Finish and Sharks. It's Ace of Vegas. We're signing out. Wishing you strong hands, happy spinning. And of course, if Roger were here, I'd be saying, Good night, everybody. Nice. Good deal. Yeah, this is going to be a really, really great team. I can't wait to see you guys all next week.